And everywhere I'm going across Ontario, I'm hearing the same thing here in uh, Coburg. People are fed up, fed up with the highest hydro rates in North America. I just talked to a gentleman, head of the union, uh, that had worked at the GE plant over in Peterborough, and they've closed down. We've lost over 300,000 manufacturing jobs in Ontario under the Liberal government. We have to create the environment to create companies coming back here, employing people. We have to cut the red tape, the regulations. We have to lower the hydro rates. We have the highest in North America. You have to get rid of the carbon tax and put an environment together that entrepreneurs and businesses want to open up. Right now, you come up to Ontario, it's endless regulations, endless taxes. Companies don't want that. They want lower taxes. They want to make sure that they don't have the burden of a carbon tax when they're trying to compete worldwide. They want to make sure we have the lowest hydro rates. Uh, I'm 17 years old. I'm in high school. I'm a local journalist here in Coburg. Um, I'm interviewing you right now. What is your message to our demographic, our younger viewers, my friends, uh, for the next generation here in, in Ontario? Well, I just met with a group of students at Queen's, and I'm going around all these universities. Number one issue with all the students is, I want a job when I get out. And there aren't jobs out there for them. So we're going to create an environment to create jobs. And your generation is burdened with this debt. Your children are burdened with this debt of $312 billion. By the time another 10 years, well, it won't be because we're going to pay it down. But if we let it continue, it'd be over $400 billion. And we'd be number one line item would be paying interest on the, on the debt. That's the third largest line item. Just imagine what we could generate if we had that $12 billion to put back into the economy. We're gonna pay down our debt. We're gonna make it better for people like yourself when you go out and look for employment. By that time, this province will be thriving. It's important for me to have a leader here um, to show that uh, you know our party cares about this community, about Northumberland, Peterborough South. I'm hearing at the doors, people are working harder, they're getting less. It's about creating the conditions for greater opportunity in our community. I mean, you saw the crowd here. Uh, we haven't seen crowds like this um, in politics in this community in years. And so it's important to me uh, to ensure that we create the conditions so that people graduating from schools, so that there's jobs there for them you know, to take, and they can live in our community. It's ensuring that we're training people for the skill set for tomorrow's jobs, not yesterday's. And uh, so I'm excited to have Doug in town. We're about to make a major jobs announcement um, right here at a local business at Lawrence & Sons next, and so I'm excited.